What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt Deville with Counterpunch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Canelo Alvarez, Eddie Hearn, Edgar Balanga. Get this. Edgar Balanga could fight Canelo Alvarez in 2024, says Eddie Hearn. Wow. Mm -hmm. um, Eddie Hearn is chomping at the bit to sign the popular New Yorker Edgar Balanga to match him against Canelo Alvarez in 2024. Hearn still says Belonga, which is 20-0 with 16 KOs, still needs to improve himself against three ranked, world-ranked contenders this year for him to get a fight against Canelo. Unfortunately, Hearn isn't saying who the 25-year-old Belonga must beat for his three fights this year, but hopefully is not a bunch of old, over-the-hill, faded veterans or former world champions pushing 40 years old. You can argue that promoters are looking to sign Belonga so they can take advantage of his ability to sell tickets in New York. His fans turn up to see him and don't seem to care that he's fighting. Sorry, opposition. You've got to give him credit for being honest, at least about his intentions of putting Belonga in the cash out fight against Canelo Alvarez. And this is what he had to say. He said, I hope we can. We had a nice meeting with him. He's obviously meeting everyone. But the fight for Edgar Belanga, subject to him proving he's on the next level, is Canelo Alvarez. Mexico against Puerto Rico. It's a monster fight, said Eddie Hearn. He said, um, but not until next year. I think he'll have three fights and then he'll be ready. So we'll see what he decides to do. He says you can't make that fight now and say that it's a competitive fight, I think. It will be competitive, but we will have to see Edgar Belonga in world rank fights and let me counterpunch. I absolutely agree. Edgar Belonga has showed me when he took on guys that had no re no business being in there with him based on his hype. Mm -hmm. Edgar Belonga was a guy that was mad because another guy could box. Well, you're going to be disappointed and going to have long nights or, or you're going to get stopped or knocked out if you think that these guys are just going to let you stand in front of them and you throw these heavy-ass hands, these hooks, these right crosses, these uppercuts at these cats and knock them spark out. It's not going to work like that. People aren't going to go for that type of mess, man. They're not. They're not going to fall for it. They're not, they're not going to allow that. Why? Because it's called experience. They're not one-dimensional. You're going to have to be able and learn how to cut off the ring. You're going to have to be able to take it as well as dish it out, okay? So a fight like that, what like Mungia, is not out of the question. It's just the problem is, Belonga, I think, hits hard enough to break Mungia's jaw with his mouth wide open like that, you know, because he's just like, I've been saying this for years about Mungia. I like the kid. I like how he fights. He's very tough. He's very uh, active. He's very aggressive. He's very fan, fan friendly, but he holds his mouth open like Victor Ortiz, and Victor Ortiz had to learn the hard way. You better ask Josecito Lopez about that, right? Because he got his jaw broken as well by Josecito Lopez. Now, maybe Belanga is a Josecito Lopez, right? Because that could possibly happen the way he keeps his mouth open all the time. You keep your chin tucked and your mouth closed, right? Breathe through your nose, bars that's how you do it all right but yes he does have to fight other opposition um he does need to uh show himself worthy of a canelo fight you just don't throw him in there with canelo because what happens is he gets a canelo fight and all these other guys that were sitting in line doing a not a damn thing are going to criticize canelo for fighting someone that hasn't done a damn thing either like who? Like Jamal Charlo and like a lot of these guys that just sit back and can't get fights and ain't fought in months, okay? <laughs> but anyway, you guys tell me what you think of Edgar Belonga being a future opponent for Canelo Alvarez. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been Counterpunch. Peace!